For the next hour, sit quietly and we will control all that you see and hear. Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. We're taking a look at somebody a little different today, somebody I've never heard of before, but now I know way too much about this guy. He's up in Wisconsin someplace and he runs around this little town up there, Beach Town, and uh, he's seen as kind of a guy who follows children around and films them in the area. How true that is, I don't know, but we're going to take a look at this video. Uh, actually, it's about five different pieces of five different videos that he's taken. Uh, the guy's name is Roy, uh, Burl Boy Roy is what he calls himself. Anyway, let's check this guy out. How you doing, Chauncey? Pretty good. Can we just speak over here for a real no. quick second? Uh, I'm doing an investigation. I need to talk Please to you. Please leave me alone. I haven't done anything wrong or committed a crime. Can I get your name and badge number? Yeah, it's Tyler Salvinsky, 256. And you, sir? Ryan Rossing. What's your badge number? I don't have a badge number. I got a call number. What's your call We've number? We've gone through this before. I've talked to you before, okay. Chauncey. Please. He's got something Please that he needs to say. So, no, so Chauncey, I want to talk to you about what happened at Triggs the other day. Okay. So, do you want to tell me leave your me side? Leave me alone. Of... Please. You want to tell me your side of the story? No. I'm fifth. Okay. Amendment. Okay. Leave me alone. All right, so what's going on, Chauncey, is you are banned from Triggs. You're no longer allowed to go there. If you go there, cause any more disturbances or anything like that, you could either be cited or arrested. Okay. You still out on White Pine? I'm not answering your questions. Okay, well, they're going to... They, please leave me alone. They're going to send you... I did not bother you. I did not bother you. you I did not bother anybody else. They're going to send you a notice. I don't care. You. I do. Chauncey, they're going to send you a notice that you're not allowed on their property anymore. Yeah. Okay, same with the juice bar over there. I don't they care. Don't, they don't want to do anything at this point. I don't care. We didn't ask you if you cared. Yep. I don't care. We didn't ask you if you cared. So, so it looks like Roy's, Roy's real name is Chauncey. Uh, I don't blame him so for uh, changing that on his YouTube handle. But uh, yeah, he doesn't care that he's being trespassed from all these places. Well, he will care if he goes back and he gets arrested. But right now, he doesn't care. Hello. You're harassing me. So basically what's going to happen is if you continue to go around and not obey the laws of the I'm things, going to be, be everywhere and I haven't broken a law I'm going to be everywhere well, He's telling you the I want said whatever that you're call not came in for me in I want it. Chauncey. I want that records request I okay. want our conversation, there's and I filmed our conversation over at the, at the oh, fair, and it's a matter of public record. There's a process for that. You can yep. sure do that. Chauncey, I, I just I can do it verbally right now. I, I just want to... I? Chauncey, no, can you just listen to me? I can't. No. Oh, I got to fill out a form? Yeah. Yep. Can you just listen to me for one? No. So basically, I just... Don't go into Triggs anymore. Leave me okay? alone. Don't go in... Do you understand Leave me you're alone. not allowed? Do you understand, do you understand that you're not allowed to talk to you? I'm allowed to talk to you. No, you're not. Yeah, I am. Leave me alone. I could stand right here all day long. Do it. Okay. So you're not allowed to go into Triggs Leave anymore. Me alone. I'm officially noticing. Leave me alone. See, th uh, seems to think he can make a verbal demand for a records request and they have to produce it to him on the spot. I've seen him do it in two or three of his videos. And uh, of course that's not how it works. But Chauncey, he's not a very bright guy. Leave me alone. You're free to go. You're free to go. All right. You're dismissed. So are you. Bye. Bye. You busy, Andy? <laughs> Wait a minute, Andy offers to show him what? A video of your unit? How could he possibly have a video of your unit? And, uh, Chauncey? I'm sure it's you right now, should we I'll talk inside? No. I got it. I'll be here. I'll be here. I must be missing the conversation he says he's having on screen because I haven't heard him say anything like that. I'm a ginger. Right now you are. It's two yeah, it's another oh. I also uploaded all my footage of the uh, the night that I was at the oh, fair. I didn't know you were still here. Did you need something else, Chauncey? No, I'm just telling you that if you wanted to look through the contents on my phone, that I, uh, the contents of the video that I made, you can. I'll show you the video. And you can listen to our conversation and you can we see everything that I filmed that day. 
Yeah. What are you? Are you talking about the fairgrounds thing? Yeah, the fairgrounds. Okay. Well, I asked. I asked if you would be willing to show me on your phone that night, and you said no. So that's kind of a. Well, my phone is mine. Right. It's a, it doesn't matter. It's water. It doesn't matter. It didn't matter at the beginning. Water under the bridge. It's no big deal. So the backstory is Chauncey was at the fairground, and he was surrounding himself with little children, fumbling them, and giving them candy and stuff like that. And a lot of the adults complained and told him to stop it, and he wouldn't. That's what the uh, that's what the complaints about. And that lady false reported on me. She could have easily went over to the beer tent and told everyone that I was molesting her kid, and I would have got the shit beat out of her. I get that. I don't think that's what happened. Yeah, that's 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 that. And then that that's happened before too. Uh, I've read instances and seen instances. The world boy is establishing a pattern of behavior where he go, approaches children and people think he's trying to do things to them. Uh, so I don't know whose uh, fault it is that you're being viewed that way. The fact that you run around town in a speedo, I guess, is probably part of that reason. Anyway. Where a guy goes to uh, snap pictures of his kid in a little league game, and it's not his week to have his kid. He's going through divorce and gets the shit kicked out of him by the people in the crowd. This is the individual that calls him uh, Burl Boy Roy. This is the guy right here. All the pictures you saw that I filled in while I was talking is actually this guy. Him laying in a speedo on the beach and uh, yeah, he travels around that way. Him giving candy to a kid, that was him. Anyway, let's, uh, let's watch a little bit more of something else. This video is pretty much over. The next video is of him trying to make a public request over the phone for records. It uh, didn't go very well. Hi, Sergeant Ross. Um, I'd like to file a complaint against uh, a couple of your officers and I'd like to uh, make a public records request. Okay. Let's give me a second here. What happened? Um, well, failure to ID properly, failure to respond to public records requests. For Ryan Rossing and Tyler Sil Sil Slavinsky, 256. The laws that they broke were uh, section subsection 19.31 to 19.39 Wisconsin state statutes under the Wisconsin public records law. Uh, um, they came up to me and I was standing on the sidewalk and I asked them both to ID. Tyler did. He said his name was Tyler Slavensky. He said his uh, number was 256. Ryan said his name, but he failed to give his call number. Um, and uh, uh, he spoke about an incident uh, where, we, uh, where we had talked before, and then I asked him for those public records, and he uh, turned around and walked away from me real fast. Those are the first two officers in this video that, uh, yeah, they said, yeah, there's a process for that, and tried to tell him how to do it, but... He didn't care, remember? Uh, 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 to do a, 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 an investigation on somebody is, is a public thing. I mean, you guys don't have the right to do a private investigation on somebody and then withhold all those records. If I, uh, if I, give, a verbal, if I give a verbal request for public records, you have to respond verbally, and that can't be a no. You have to do it this way or that way because the law specifically states that I can ask in any form, and you have to respond in kind. So if I respond verbally to you, you have to respond verbally to me. Yeah, I don't think that's the way it's written. That is the way it's written. I read the whole thing. It is a Wisconsin public records law that was enacted in 1980, section subsection 19.31 to 19.39. It specifically says that you cannot make a format out of me requesting public records that there is no format that I have to follow. All I have to do is ask verbally or write, or it says any method. And you can look it up. I mean, your officers don't follow the law. They don't follow their duty. I'm not going to bother looking all that nonsense up. I'm sure it may, it may say that. I don't know. I don't care. It's just the way he's going about it that's uh, irritating. Record were you requesting? I was requesting all the records from the fair. Tyler knows what records. Uh, the law also states that it's proper to go to the person that made the record. So it was proper for me to go to Tyler and Ryan for all that stuff. I spoke to Ryan at the fair last year and I want 
his body cam, all video and audio. I want his cruiser cam, all video and audio for the entire day. And then I want all of Tyler's, and I want the entire investigation that he did on me. I want all the body cam. I want all the uh, reports. And if you want, I mean, I'll meet you guys somewhere or I'll come down, just as long as you promise not to, you know, hurt me. So who are you? Uh, I don't really want to say my name. You guys know who I am. I can't give you a record, but I don't know who you are. Yeah, you can. The law specifically states that I don't have to ID myself. Have you ever read the law? I mean, or are you just pretending that you don't know it? I'm not trying to be rude. I'm actually asking a question because I think that the Pharisees panning back to that kid in the blue over and over. Your officers need to be trained a little bit, and I don't want to have to get a lawyer and sue. Um, Goes on for a few more minutes demanding his records request and all that. Won't give him any information as to who to send it to. I'm going to only show one more clip of uh, where he's being accused of uh, checking out kids all day long. I want all the dispatch that came in on me. We don't, I, well one, I don't know who you are. You don't have to know who I am and it is not a requirement of the law for you to know stop, who I am. Stop, I am trying to comply with your request, but your request is overly broad. Mm, if you want to, if, so if you're expecting five days worth of video um, that has to be redacted of juveniles and other things, I need to know what I'm supposed to be redacting. You don't, you don't have to redact uh, juveniles. All you have to do is if uh, somebody gives uh, an address. No, we do have to redact No, juveniles. No, you don't. I've, I've seen so much footage that's, that you don't. Here's the, what the law says. You, if you're asking me what the law says, I can tell you. And I'll make it very clear for you. you in an anonymous form and in writing exactly what you're requesting. I do not have to put it in writing. The law says I can make a verbal request and that is just fine. You do not know if I'm disabled or not, lady. Yeah, but you don't know if I have trouble seeing, you don't know if I have trouble typing, you don't know if I have trouble spelling. Well, we do know there's one thing you have trouble with, and that's listening and paying attention to what you need to do to get what you want to get. And this law was enacted so people that can get records that are disabled, it's for everybody. And it says I can verbally request. And if you want to know what you have to redact, you have to redact addresses and social security numbers. I don't want to see any addresses. I don't want to see any social security numbers. I mean, are you scared to give me the records that I want? I, I, I'm not going to sue you if I get the records that I request. Did you hang up on me? You, oh, hung up on me. I don't know if he hung up on you or not. I would have by now because you're an idiot, but uh, hey. Um, did, did we lose our call? Did you hang up on me? I have not talked to you. Um, I just called in. I was, I was speaking to a, a Ross, I, I believe, and then a woman on the phone. And okay, give me one moment. Let me try to figure it out. Well, indeed, she did hang up on him. That's too bad, isn't it? Hello, Police Department Chris Dobbs. Hi, I was just speaking with somebody. Was that you? Please. Probably. Did you hang up on me? Or did, so, did the call I'm get dropped? I'm listening to some of the calls, or I'm looking at some of the calls on that date. You definitely won't get any information in regard to a sexual assault report that we had. Um, there's there's going to be restrictions and caveats on your request. Um, so, well, all I need is the stuff that pertained to me that day. I, it, it, uh, somebody called in about me having a camera. So that's all I'm looking for. At the fair. Okay. Yeah. That I can, I can get that printed out and the photo of it or the video of it. Okay. That would be nice. As I mean, it's safe because if it was not an arrest 
or not? No, they, they, this is what happened. Uh, and I have this all on tape. Uh, they arrested me, and then they figured out that I knew the law, so they unarrested me. Yeah, nice try, Chauncey, but that did not happen. But they did say that I was under arrest. They did place me in cuffs, and they did hold my Fifth Amendment against me to, to be released from cuffs. And uh, there's so much that's wrong with that video. Your police officers, just they need training. They need to treat people okay. with respect. Okay, I have no problem giving you that tape, but the uh, people, in, or that copy of that video, but people in the background will be blurred out. You will hear sound, and you will see yourself and the officers interacting with you, but the faces in the background will be blurred out. Okay. I'm you know if that. you want to go through all that trouble, I'm. There's, there's plenty of. Uh, we have to. No, we no, you have don't. To. No, no, you don't. Yes, we do. Learn the law. N yes, we do. No, you don't. So anyway. It sounds like he's uh, dying to get more video of the same thing he already has video of, so he can relive the experience. It's a thing that child predators do. That's uh, just allegedly. That's what Chauncey's doing. Uh, we don't know for a fact that that's what he's doing, but it sure would appear that way to the reasonable person. There may be a cost depending upon how long it takes the clerk to do No, you cannot put a fi you can you cannot you yes, you cannot can. do a whole bunch of work and then then charge me hour by hour. Read read the updates with the state. I don't no 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 no. No no, anyway. lady, those those records are there for let me come over and video record it with my own Phone then, so and I can do a cheat. Yes, I can. Okay, so we'll have it ready here in a couple of days. It'll be here, and I don't know how to get in touch with you to tell you it's done. So if you want to try, I, to what I need to know, I, I'll, I'll give you my number, and 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 or and what I need to know is 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 what it's going to cost me. Are you going to charge me thousands of dollars for this information? That's not lawful. That's not lawful. That she's paid with she's paid with public money, and that's your duty. That's not lawful at all. So anyway, um, what's the number I can get back at, at you with? Uh, if you're gonna put like an un, uh, unlimited uh, uh, labor cost on it, I need to know what I'm looking at. Is it gonna be hundreds of dollars? I. I I need more than just that, though. I need the officers from the other day. I'm going to go ahead and end it there. I can't, I can't stand listening to this guy anymore. He's a, apparently, he wants to be a First Amendment auditor, but all of his videos pretty much have, have little ones in it. That he's always following them around and making sure he gets video of them. Uh, he's usually all by himself. Uh, you know, it's kind of strange. Doesn't mean anything, really, but it's kind of strange. Anyway. Hope you enjoyed the video. Y'all have a great day. Love y'all. Bye.